Now we have our high pressure gauge. Our high pressure gauge is connected to a hose to our high pressure side. In this case, it's our liquid line. I can tell it's a liquid line because we have our liquid line filter dryer here. But this smaller line is our liquid line, high pressure side. So if we're looking at it, my gauge on our refrigeration cycle is hooked up right about here. But it's representing the pressure of everything on the red side, all the high pressure. It's pretty close to the same. It's all going to be the same pressure. We have a pressure of 330 PSI gauge. That number doesn't mean anything. So again, we're going to take our temperature pressure chart and try our number of 330. Converts to a saturated temperature of 102.9. We're going to round that to 103. So 103 degrees, that means the majority of this condensing coil, if we look at our refrigeration cycle, the majority of this condensing coil is going to be 103 degrees Fahrenheit. The refrigerator is going to be changing state from a vapor to a liquid rejecting heat. So if we look at our condensing coil here, the majority of this coil is going to be 103 degrees Fahrenheit. The air temperature out here is 80 degrees, so it's 103 to 80. Heat is leaving the refrigerant, leaving the condensing coil, and going to the cooler air. We have our fan, and we're pulling air across this condensing coil. And if I feel the air here, it's warmer. Heat is leaving the refrigerant and going to the air. The air is warming up. The refrigerant is changing state from vapor to a liquid. It's rejecting heat. Again, this is latent heat. It's very, very powerful. That refrigerant changing state is a really big deal. It's very important. So by knowing that, we know that the refrigerant's condensing in the most of this, changing it from a vapor back into a liquid, massive amounts of latent heat being rejected. We take the pressure, which is pretty well worthless, and we convert it to a saturated temperature, a condensing temperature inside of our units. That is the key to what we're working with.